wife, Michelle. The mouse-eating python. Ratso Entertainment proudly presents Wesley. The longest worm in the world. Huh? Hey. Huh? Huh? Guys, please, wait! Don't go! There's so much more to see! Oh, God, this stinks more than my sewer! Oh. Nice show, Wes. That's it! Huh? I quit! What? You can't quit now? That was your best show yet! They hated me! The act stinks! I need a new manager! <gasps> Manager? But, 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 but what about the carnival? My cousin Ernie's got the whole thing set up. This is the booking we've been waiting for. Mm -hmm. Fame mm -hmm. and fortune are calling. That's so Wesley. Come on, buddy. I can't do this on my own. Then find someone else. Someone else? But you're the only friend I've got. I've got news for you, Ratso. You don't have any friends. You... Don't mean that. You're just high on your own success. <gasps> what are you doing? <sighs> Someday you'll thank me, buddy. <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello, Ratso. Phyllis, what a surprise. Did you honestly think I wouldn't find you? Uh, honestly? Yes. Come on, Phyllis. Nobody wants this. I got big plans. Let me have my life. Show's over, Ratso. Well, I guess there's no point in running. None. What the <laughs> heck? <laughs> Belongs to me, Ratso. And I'm gonna find you. Whatever it takes. Wesley, we're on our way.
the carnival! <laughs> A minute. What did you do with the city? Forget the city. I saw it, Wes. I saw the carnival. It was beautiful. Don't you get it? I'm not going! But, but you gotta go. Do you mind? I'll give you anything you want. You give me anything? Anything. What is your problem? All I want's a bit of respect. You got it. What? Ah, beat it, kid. And uh, some kind of wheels. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm thinking solid gold. Ah! <laughs> Ratso? Hello? Oh, come on, it stinks in here. Wesley? <gasps> okay. That's it. You've messed with the wrong rat. What? Are you laughing in there? Okay. Let's do this thing. Such a joy at this age. Shut up. Now who are you? And what do you think you're doing with that egg? Uh, I'm Ratso, and, uh, and I've forgotten the second half of your question. Oh. Anywho, it's been a real pleasure. Stay beautiful. Taxi. Ow. I am <laughs> seem to be having some trouble. Finding the door. Once you're in the duckyard, there's no way out. But what if he's an egg thief? <laughs> an egg thief? Me? No. You got it all wrong. I'll be honest with you, honey. Can I call you honey? No. Listen, honey. This isn't just any egg. It's... <laughs> my egg. <laughs> How could a rat lay an egg? I didn't. My beautiful lady wife. Frankenzilla. Frankenzilla. <laughs> May she waddle forever in the big duck yard in the sky. Laid this egg moments before she... Before she... I can't say it. <laughs> why, why her? Why didn't you take me? Her last wish was that our baby would be brought up in the duckyard she was raised in. The city is no place for a little one. <laughs> You're not fooling anyone, mister. Well, maybe the chickens, but that's about it. Do you really expect us to believe that a rat, the lowest, dirtiest, most double-crossing, selfish, nasty... Okay, okay. We all know what a rat is. Could possibly be the father of an egg. Besides, I don't remember any Frankenzilla. Sure you do. She had feathers and wings. <laughs> And, uh, a beak on her head? What was it she used to say all the time? <laughs> oh, yeah. Quack. I remember her. You do? Daphne? Yeah. Nice girl. Feathers, wings, 
<laughs> Terrible taste in men. <laughs> oh, yeah. I remember. I hugged huh? that thing. <laughs> oh, grief. That's the ugliest duckling I've ever seen. He's the father, all right. Now you run along, you ugly. They'll look after you here. Mama! <laughs> Don't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <clears throat> if this duckling is truly one of our own, he can stay in the duckyard, ugly as he may be. But he's your son, and you must raise him. Otherwise, you'll just take him up space. <laughs> You're right. What sort of a father would I be if I refused to be a mother to my own son? Mama! And you, only Ratso. Huh? Ah. No way out. We'll see about that. Gotta find Wesley. It's gonna be the biggest thing to hit the carnival since the big wheel fell over. They haven't made a duckyard that can hold Ratso. At least, I don't think they have. It's never really come up before. Mama? <laughs> Mama! Right, number one. I don't want you calling me Mama or anything else for that matter. Number two. Just stay out of my way and everything will be fine. Number... What's wrong with your face? You look uglier than usual. What are you doing? What's wrong with you? What do you want from me? Huh? He wants you to be his father. Oh, that's so sweet. You're really good with him. Would you like to keep him? Bringing up a child on your own isn't easy. And I should know. Is this your way of telling me you're single? <laughs> Why don't you take him? <laughs> What's that? That? It's a hole. The baby. I thought I'd make him a nice hole to sleep in for the night. There's an empty paint can by the coop. You could get some straw and stay in that. Even better. Hmm. Good night. Good night. Somebody <laughs> likes me. And all the little pixie children began to smile. For each daughter was prettier than the next. And the princess, with hair of gold and feathers so fair, went to find her true love. So she says, but not so fair. This is only our first date. And I'm like, listen, sugar lips, why wait for Christmas when Santa's right here on the dance floor?
Tomorrow night I'll be out of here and on my way to the carnival! What's a carnival? Well, it's... Wow! Can I come? No. Uh. Of course you can come! <laughs> you really think I'd leave you here? <laughs> Mama! Couldn't you at least call me Dad? Now go play by the water's edge. <sighs> I've got some cleaning up to do. Dream. What does it mean when a penguin eats your hat? Yeah. Is that stress? Oh, there are certain members of the duckyard who've had enough of you and your boy and this unsightly mess. It's a monstrosity. Uh, actually, it's a mountain. A mountain? Yes, we decided to build our own view. Tomorrow we're making a lake. That's <gasps> it. I want this mess gone today. But we just finished digging but up. Digging your what? Teeth into the show. Tonight was going to be the night. What show? Well, why else would we put a stage on our mountain? Doesn't look like a stage to me. We just thought, hey, let's give something back. You know, it's what showbiz folk do. Our little way of saying... Thanks. <gasps> oh, I do like a good show. Hmm? All chickens do. Can't we have hmm? just one oh. little... And the kids got talent. Huh? One and a two and a three and a... <laughs> Shake huh? it. Now that's hot. I can't stand it. Whoa, you're killing me. Ta-da. Now, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, it's raw, but it's there. Oh. Hooray! Oh, he's very uh. talented. Oh. <laughs> One show, and then I want it gone. Sunset tonight. You won't regret this. I'm watching you, <laughs> rat. Oh, is that rat? I can't see. Where is that? Get on with it. Mm -hmm. 
tough yard. I'm not doing the show. <laughs> They'll hate me. I'm no good at anything. What are you talking about? It's in your blood. You're a natural, just like your old man. They say that they, you're not really my father. <gasps> and you believed them? You sure don't look like me. I got a little beak, little wings. They're all feathery. Well, not from the front. You look like your mother from the front, <gasps> like a duck. I do. But from behind. You got my looks. Really? That's my boy. Now let's get out there and show them our stuff. Okay. <sighs> Hi. I just thought, since you didn't have anyone else to wish you luck, that I might. Good luck. Hey, thanks. But we don't need luck. I do. Are you sure this is a good idea? You're so sweet to worry, but don't. I'll be fine. I was talking about ugly. Oh, him! <laughs> right. <laughs> what was the question again? I just hope you know what you're doing. Come on, Mom. Hurry up. up. Good luck. <clears throat> Ladies and <laughs> Ladies, have we got a show for you tonight? Brace yourself for a night of Whoa, I know that voice. <clears throat> when I first met this little guy, he was nothing. He couldn't sing, couldn't dance, he couldn't even tell a joke. Nobody would have paid to come and see him. But that's all changed now, because tonight, he's appearing for free! Huh? What? How come I got stuck with the most annoying brothers in the... Well, well. What do we have here? I give you... Ugly! No hard feelings, kid. Has he started yet? <laughs> Oh, get on with it! What a ripper! <laughs> the point is, I found it. You didn't find it. You fell in it. Well, you two, shut up. That's one of Ratso's shows, all right. Huh? Stan. You stay here and guard the tunnel. Frank and I are going to take a look around. <gasps> Maybe he's already gone. Impossible. There's only one way out and stand. Uh, I got a question. Guarding it. If at any time I have to come in here and ask you a question, Daniel guards the tunnel. <laughs> Free at last! Wesley, I'm back! Where are you? Huh? Wesley? Get moving, boys! The kindergarten car! <laughs> Oh. I knew oh. you'd wait. Wait? Do you have any idea how long I've been in this bottle? Oh my God, huh? Dan. Huh? You want him to get away? Oh. 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 
Doesn't she ever give up? Let's hope she doesn't know about the carnival. I am not going to the carnival! <laughs> Another act. You might as well just go home. That's what I was trying to do. I'd never forget you. Gold mine? I meant sun. Does this mean you're taking me with you? Step right up. Not sure if this is good for me. Silence, worm. I'm looking for Rapso, and you're gonna tell me where he is. He was going to a carnival. I think he's bringing some kind of duck. But between you and me, love, I don't think the kids got what it takes. Which way? <sighs> they went that way. Let him go. <laughs> Could you at least point me in the direction of the sea? <laughs> see beautiful just wait till you see the lights of the carnival you never told me what's a carnival what's a carnival how can i put this it's only the greatest place in the world Whoa. and this my bizarre looking little friend is a map to the carnival see that's it right there we're like three inches away <laughs> all we have to do is get there my cousin Ernie will do the rest. He's very big in the biz. Your cousin would do that for us? Wow, he sounds like a true friend. More of a pen pal than a friend. You never met him? I'm curious. Did I teach you to talk? I don't remember teaching you to talk. I don't remember anybody teaching you to talk. And yet, you talk. look kind of creepy. You don't have to be scared of the woods. They can't hurt you. It's the things that live in the woods you should be worried about. Ah. <laughs> okay, okay. Look, when you get scared, all you have to do is cry out for help, and Ratso the Ruthless will... Help! Shh! No, not like that. Like this. Help. Me. That's all the ruthless, okay? Okay. Dad, I've been thinking about the carnival. <sighs> Are we really gonna be famous? With your talent and my greed, we can't fail. But what talent? They just laughed at me. Yes, but 
They never got to see you dance. You got a dancer's physique, just like your mom. My mom was a dancer? Oh, yeah. Very light on her flippers. I see a lot of her in you. Now, dance for me. Uh, now? Yes. But, but I can't. Dance. <sighs> this is going to be huge. <laughs> Let's not wear ourselves out. But you truly have a gift. How many legs do you have? Legs? How many? Uh, two. Incredible! I find it hard to believe that someone with only two legs could dance with such magnificence. Just two? Are you sure? Have you counted them recently? <laughs> Just two. <laughs> Let's get out of here. But, Dad, she asked us to help her. No, she didn't. She said, leave me. I can see how you were confused. Ugly? Here comes Blackstar the Ruthless. Oh, oh, no. You're a great-looking lady, a, a foxy vixen. You're just a, the smallest bit, oh, I don't know, chunky around the hips. Not a lot, but, you know, a, a little. I, I was the same way, and you know how I lost it? I completely cut out snacking. If you don't eat us, this could be you. <laughs> You can't! I'm a mother now! <laughs> I can't eat that! <laughs> you know, you wouldn't be the first rat who made it onto my menu. <laughs> yeah, you make me sick! Really? So long, Chunky. Fellas! Huh. Did I say something? No. no. That's strange. Are you sure? Yes. yes. I didn't say something like, Hey guys, why did you take a break? No. no. Then why are you taking a break? Oh. Can't we just go back to the city and get someone else? Yeah, Frank's right! <laughs> We've got to find him! There is no one else! The sooner we get to the carnival, the better. Boy, have I got some stories for Ernie! Would you mind if I built up the whole me fighting the fox thing? Uh, Maybe added a little sword fight? Uh, what is it now, Chuckles? You didn't scare the fox away. I did. 
with my ugly face. True, although I still think the sword fight sounds better. But we can work that out on the way. I'm just an ugly freak. But that's the point. That's the point? <laughs> of life. That's the point of life. If everybody was the same, the world would be a very boring place. Right? Anyway, you're not as different as you might think. Deep down, everybody's... Beautiful? No. Everybody's ugly. You see, beautiful people spend all their time trying to stay beautiful. But beauty's a passing thing. And by the time they figure that out, they've wasted their lives on hand cream and early nights. It's guys like you and me that have all the fun. I still don't get it. Don't worry. It'll all make sense when you grow up. Yeah. <gasps> I can't wait till I'm a grown-up. Uh, don't hold your breath, kid. <sighs> Growing up isn't something that happens overnight. I can see that. No, I mean, it's me. Ugly. Huh? Freaky. This is great. I mean, you were ugly before, but now. <laughs> but now, I think you've really grown into yourself. <laughs> really? Sure. Well, don't go on about it. <gasps> what was all that about? I don't know. Well, that's not annoying. I can't help it. I feel weird. Not that you care. Huh? Now what? You wouldn't understand. Understand what? Exactly! You've changed. Duh. Interesting. What if I was to ask you to give me a hug? You are so embarrassing. I see. And what if I told you you weren't allowed to fly until you were 16? No way! You can't do that! That is so unfair! I think I know what's wrong with you. You, you do? Yeah. I've seen this kind of thing before. It even happened to me once. You've turned into a teenager. This is all I need. What's wrong with being a teenager? What's wrong with it? I'll tell you what's wrong with it. First of all, you're going to want to have a mind of your own. Don't tell me what to think, Dad. But, Dad... Then you'll lose all respect for me, like, I'm ashamed of you, old man. Now you tell me, how am I supposed to get things done with you acting up all the time? But... Ow! Huh? Oh. Typical teenager. Prime of your life and you just lie around the place. But, Dad... I don't know how to be a teenager. It's easy. You just speak funny, be rude to your parents, and fall in love with the first girl who smiles at you. Hi. Huh? <gasps> it's you. Huh? Jesse, and look who's all grown up. <laughs> Cut it out, sister. Boy, I'm glad to see you guys. I've been looking everywhere. I'll bet. I didn't think I'd ever catch up with you. That fox banged me up pretty good. I think my wing is broken. Does it hurt? A little. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back it up. Jeff, right? Jesse. Whatever. Nice to see you. But we've really got to be going. But, Dad... Let's go, ugly. I, I was wondering... You see, my family have already flown south for the winter, and, well, do you think I could tag along with you two for a while? Oh, that would be great. Huh? Just until my wing gets better. Not a chance. Me and my boy work alone. Plus, I have a no girls on adventures policy. It's just that I really don't fancy my chances here in Fox Country. You'd only slow us down. <laughs> Come on. Mm -mm. Okay, I've thought about it and have decided to let Jeff come along on a trial basis. What are you waiting for? 
Let's go! Huh? <laughs> Looks like the worm was right. Ratso has found himself a little friend. So that's what that blue line means. It looked so cute on the map. How are we ever going to get across that? Oh, it's easy. All we have to do is... Whoa, whoa. I was talking to me. You can tag along, but I'm calling the shots here. But I... I can do this. Fine. Yeah? Yeah. Huh. It looks pretty thin. By the way, the other thing about teenagers is they... they love adventure. Huh? The more danger, the better. Oh, no. We're not going out there. There you go with that mind of your own thing again. You have to go first. I can't swim. But we're heavier than you. Exactly. If you make it, I'll definitely be safe. In that case, uh, we're definitely not going. You have to. Why? Well, well, because I'm the grown-up and I tell you to. Why? Because, because... Yeah. Okay, fine. I'll do it. But I'm warning you, if anything happens to me, you'll be heartbroken. Sending his own father out onto an icy death trap. I'm really gonna do this, you know. Sure you are. Watch me. <laughs> Listen here, young man. I've had just about enough of you carrying on. And if I ask you to do something in future, you'd better just darn well do it. <laughs> Oh, it's not such a big deal. I just... Uh, you huh? heard him. No big deal. Listen, Jeff, if that even is your real name, if your wing is really broken, which it isn't, then how did you get across the river? I used the bridge. I try to tell you. Huh? Excuse me. <laughs> Huh? 
It's nice that you let Jesse rest while we get the wood. Yeah, well, sometimes you have to give women a little privacy. Otherwise, they'll talk to you. What do you think of Jesse? I wish the fox had eaten her. I like her too. How do you like your sling? Is it okay? It's perfect. <sighs> listen, ugly. I, I don't want you to say anything. Just listen. And no tears. I hate tears. I've been doing a lot of thinking, and maybe I haven't been the best dad. But I was getting used to the job. I'm even starting to miss it when it was just the two of us, if you can believe that. <laughs> and I, I know you like this girl and all, and, and I don't blame you much. But we're a family now. We got each other. We don't need anybody else. I'm sorry. I don't even know why I'm laughing. Wait a minute. That's not me. <laughs> hey. <laughs> well, go on then. I'm waiting. <laughs> I, I can't do it here. I feel silly. If you can't dance in front of me, then how are you going to be able to dance in front of an audience? Well, okay, here goes. Yay! <laughs> yeah, come on! Woo! <laughs> you are too funny. <laughs> oh, you're serious. Oh. No, wait! I didn't mean to laugh. I I just wasn't expecting something, so... I just thought you would be less... Uh... I think the word you're looking for is ugly. Oh, nice going, Jesse. How are you kids this morning? Sleep well? You couldn't be happier, could you? Whatever could you mean? <laughs> you know exactly what I mean. You've been trying to turn ugly against me since the moment we met. For his own good. You're nothing but trouble. What? Let me see. So far, you've broken your wing, his heart, and my blanket. I broke his heart. Mm. You're the one who told him he could dance. What were you thinking? He's going to look like a, a freak up there. Mm. But you already know that, don't you? Look, success is success. Do you really think that once he's got it, he's going to care where it came from? How can you say that? You're all he's got. He trusts you. Well, I never asked him to. Come on, ugly. We're going. What? Dad. Don't go, ugly. Just Dad. stay out of it, Jeff. Ow. Dad. Don't. Poke me. I didn't. Ah! Ah! Why don't you both just leave me alone? Ugly, come back. Stay away from me. I can take care of myself. Now look what you've done. There, ugly. That hurt. The carnival. That's right, buddy. We're going to the carnival. No, Razzo. The carnival. <laughs> ugly. We did it. <laughs> Come on, Ugg. Let's roll. Give it to me! 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 Give it to
<laughs> hey, fellas, you know where I could find Ernie? Who wants to know? Me? Yeah. But who are you? I'm Ratso, Ernie's cousin. <gasps> You're Ernie's cousin? Yes. Hello, Radso. Happy to see me? Yeah, wait, wait. Well, of course. I've been looking all over for you. Sure, you have. <laughs> Ratso! That's far enough, bird. Now, where were we? Let's all just calm down. Well, I explain. <laughs> What's the matter, Ratso? Cat got your tongue? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they've got him mad now! Yeah, I'm talking to you, man. Fight! 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 Just there, man! Come on! Gonna get to Ratso now. Yeah, yeah, here we go. Hmm. It's obvious. Ernie must have been adopted. Not that. We don't need to get to Ratso. We'll get him to come to us. Ha! <laughs> oh, this is nice. It's been so long since I had family around, I thought I was gonna go crazy. Ask William, he'll tell you. Tell him yourself, fatso! William, please, not in front of family. Ha! <laughs> family? Are you sure we're related? It's obvious. I'm furry, you're furry, we both got eyes, and we're both pretty. Yeah. 
If that's your cousin, I'm your mother. Yum. Ah, here we are. Tonight, we'll give them a show they'll never forget. Tonight? Oh, yeah. Not a moment too soon. <laughs> Ventriloquism isn't so popular anymore. We've had a really bad summer. And I wonder why. Oh, yes. You're no talent bum. William. Anyway, the point is we really need a new act. Which reminds me, what's your big act anyway? My act? Oh, it's, uh... Well, it's... It's, uh... It's... It's me! Huh? I'm the show! Ah, how nice! <laughs> <sighs> Look, guys, about the show, maybe... I know what you're thinking. What to wear, right? Don't <laughs> worry, we'll fix you right up. <laughs> you don't think we send you out on stage wearing that, do you? But... This is my fur. That's fur? You don't have to do this, you know. What do you mean? Can't you see he's using you? What do you care? Oh, you're the one who laughed at me. Wake up, Ugly. Do you really think he's putting you on stage to dance? Not everybody looks at me and sees the monster that you do. Cat crew. <clears throat> Who are you? And what are you doing in my duckyard? <laughs> Frank. Uh, I'm on it. That's settled then. Stan, huh? go and make the arrangements. Oh, yeah. I have business to attend to. Oh, oh, all right, all right, I'm going, I'm going. <laughs> How big that audience is? Pretty unbelievable. I would have given up a long time ago if it hadn't been for you. Whatever happens here, I've got you to thank. Listen, ugly about the show. How do I look? Oh. We got a show for you. Tell the people what they want to hear, William. Oh, it's big, it's horrific, it's hilarious, and it's here. <laughs> There's only one guy we have to thank for that. Please welcome my very own cousin, and I'm not going to lie to you, he's Richie Rexo! You're up, Rexo. The crowd is on fire. No. Maybe... Maybe you're not quite ready. Ah, uh, don't worry about me, Dad. It's in my blood, remember? Uh but... You're a natural. But I... Just like your old man. But... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We've come a long way to be here tonight, and, and it wasn't easy. Oh, for heaven's sake. This is rubbish. <laughs> oh! <gasps> Mm. It was fun. Hey, get on with it. But now we're here and, and we're ready. The question is, are you? I'm sorry. I just can't do it. Ah, come on. Ew. Ratso. He's running everything! Honey, I'm starting to panic! Don't panic, don't panic! What are we gonna do? Oh, I can't feel my legs! 
legs! I can't feel my legs! I'm going on! Oh. <laughs> that has to be the ugliest duckling in the world! <laughs> Why you brought me here? For people to laugh at me? No! Jesse was right. That's the only reason you want to be around. Yes. <laughs> I guess I'm stupid and ugly. <laughs> Try to keep the place tidy. We're expecting a very important guest. You'll be waiting a long time if you expect that rat to come to anyone's rescue. <laughs> He's the lowest, dirtiest, most double-crossing, selfish, nasty rat in the whole world. Right up. Sure. can't do it. I'm afraid of the water. What? All cats are. Wait a second. I'm not a cat. Jump on. William, you're a genius. Oh. 
in any position to give orders? <laughs> Uh-oh. Have you met my family? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I'm sorry. Happy to see you. Let's shave my legs and call me princess. It looks like we've got ourselves a fight. Attack! It's not good. I guess by tomorrow it'll all be over for me. There's, there's something I have to tell you. It's not important. You came back for me. That's all that matters, Dad. Yes. Well, you see, that's the thing. I don't know how to tell you this, but as your father, I think it's my duty. I'm not your father. Hmm. You knew. I'm not sure, but it didn't seem to matter. You were a father to me. Oh. Oh. And if this is going to be our last night together, I don't want to waste a second of it. Talk to me, Ratso. It's time. <laughs> Dead rat walking. Dead. <laughs> On your knees. Don't be nervous, Ratso. It'll all be over before you know it. <laughs> no, wait. I'm too young. 
Pleasing some people. Stop the execution! Execution? This isn't an execution. Huh? Ratso? You're getting married? Ugly? You you're a swan? <gasps> I'm a swan? Would someone like to tell me what's going on here? I don't think I can. I don't think I want to. I'll tell you what's going on. This sorry excuse for a rat ran away a year ago in the middle of our wedding. <gasps> what? It was supposed to be my special day. Oh. She forced me into it. <laughs> she never loved me. <gasps> Is this true? Of course it's true. How could anyone possibly love that? Unfortunately, that was the last single no-strings-attached rat in the city. But why would you want to marry someone you don't love? No! Shut up! There's more to marriage than love. There's the ring. There's the cake. There's the flowers. And there's the gifts. Millions of gifts! Now, make me Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm sorry. Did you say dad? Uh-huh. You've got kids? I know. I'm so lucky. And would you believe I have no idea who the mother is? is with us now but I can't just leave I'm not like you I'm different it matters not that you were born in a duckyard not when you have lain in a swan's egg are more important than beauty. True, but until they're discovered, you should come with us. What about love? Love? Hmm. Thanks, guys, but I've got to go. Back? 
The swans were right. It's time for me to be with my own kind. <laughs> I mean you guys! <laughs> this is great! A uh, little cheesy. But this is great! <laughs> Can I give you some fatherly advice? Sure. A wedding is possibly the greatest place ever to meet a girl. Hmm. So what are you doing talking to me? understand that this thing's already been paid for? You came for a party, right? Yeah! yeah! Well, what are we waiting for? Let's party! Promised her 
said she was his kind of girl. He never did that. Oh, at least that's what we heard. Acting kind of cool. He never did that. And he wants to make the rules. 